We're going to start taking it apart. Uh, one of these little uh, bit driver sets from Harbor Freight. Uh, you can pick them up for, I don't know, 8 12 bucks on sale. And a little ratchet screwdriver. It doesn't have to be a ratchet. It can just be a regular nut driver but uh, or bit driver. But that's what I use. Uh, most of these screws on here are uh, torque T15s. So that's what we're doing. Uh, the first thing I want to do is remove the power supply assembly. Uh, you'll have to take note of special connectors and things down here. And also this coax uh, that's up here that goes down, down below. So let's go ahead and uh, get to it here. already took the one off there um make sure you got a little container to stick your screws in and stuff i find an old tooting can usually works pretty well all right let's get some of these connectors and things off uh, actually there we go that one there yeah i think this one's got a little clip you pick up and you slide back hold on let's get a little screwdriver in there and get that thing back there okay I just had to pry up the end uh, make sure you are careful of all the uh, uh, stuff on the motherboard all the uh, components if you're putting screwdrivers in here and things well it's got a couple keepers on the bottom I forgot about that you have to lift the board before you can get to it they didn't necessarily make this thing easy to work on <laughs> So let me get this thing uh, rotated around here, and uh, let's see, best I remember you have to lift this up and remove this plastic piece here so you can get to the main connector in the back. There you go. And then you have to pull this one up. There we go. And you got a little keeper down here you have to lift up. Just Right up on that little brown thing. It usually uh, stays with the board though, so I have to go locate it. Take this. And there we go. Oh, forgot one down there. Let me go grab that. Alright, that's the, uh, let me focus. That's the inverter uh, connector. That's what that is. That one doesn't want to come off. All right, I got it. You just have to stick your finger right here and just kind of pull up and give it a little tug, and that'll come off. Don't like it, but that's the way it is. All right, let's uh, go ahead and flop this over. There we go. Out of the way. Now we can access uh, the main motherboard and get it up. All right, we can start by... Uh, Removing the torque tip screws. That one there. And you got, uh, I think that's three, no, two, right down in here in these holes. Alright, to uh, get this cable disconnected from this, this is actually a, a plug in cable on the back of this uh, BNC. If you can get your uh, little micro screwdriver in there, whoops, sorry, and pry it up, you may be able to just pull it too. Let me see. Oh, yeah, it'll just pull out. There we go. And that's pretty much it. Now your your motherboard is free. Now you can move on to this this stuff right here. <laughs> 